What's up, everybody? You know, I know it's been a minute. Tupac expert back in the house, man. Um, just want to tell y'all, give y'all some news about Tupac. Tupac is alive in the spirit world, and uh, he sees what's going on on this planet. Um, so, a lot of you guys that make Tupac videos don't even think about that. A lot of you guys that make Tupac videos, y'all thinking on the earth plane. Y'all thinking simple. Man, y'all can still talk to Tupac. Man, Tupac, tu I mean, Tupac is still talking, y'all. He's still alive. He's in the spirit world, but he's very, very much alive. You know what I'm saying? He's not the same person. He's not that guy that was on earth. But he has all the memories of that guy. But uh, I was watching this YouTube channeler, that channel Tupac, and she gave out some interesting information. And I know this is Tupac spirit talking. He said, first of all, some great news is that he's going to be reincarnated uh, into... I, uh, he's gonna be reincarnated in the in the in the country in the part of the uh, world around the Italy part, around that part of the world, around Italy part. You know, um, he's gonna come back as he's gonna be. Uh, he wants to be a doctor in a small little village. Around the year twenty twenty three is when he's he's supposed to be coming back. Pac always said he was coming back. So around 2023, y'all, Tupac is coming back to Earth, reincarnated. You know, um, he's on his way to becoming a, a spiritual god, a spiritual master, which is a god. You know, he only got a, a couple uh, reincarnations left till he, till he reached that god status, to, you know, till he reached the spiritual master status. On the same level as Jesus and Buddha and uh, Shiva and all that, and and we ain't surprised because we we in the black community know how powerful Pac was. You know, we he still gets gets praised today like he just died two years ago. You know, he been dead over like twenty years, right? And who gets talked about like like Pac? He's still relevant. You know what I'm saying? He's still relevant. He's the reason these rappers got the tattoos with their shirt off. He's the reason a lot of these rappers boasting, going to jail. Pop was the first one to do all that, you know. Pop, controversial. This before the internet, you know. So, Pop was doing stuff these guys doing now. Well, he ain't had the internet back then. Pop was so wise beyond his years, man, that a lot of people still emulate him to this day. Originator, man. He, he was he was a, a trendsetter, an originator. You know. Very, he was everything, man. He was everything. He was God in the physical form, man. That's what I'm trying to say. He was God in the physical form. He mastered a lot of stuff. On this planet. And uh, that's why every interview. You know. You, we just captivated by him. And every interview we he do. We can't get enough of Pop. You know. So yeah. He talked to the. He, he channeled. Uh, sort of channeler. Channeled Pop. And uh, yeah. He's going to come back in 2023. And. Uh, also. he He's not happy. He wants people to listen to his music more. He wants people to listen to the words more what he was saying in his music. Spiritual lyrics like the Holy Quran, niggas get shook like five oh. Come on, man. Who who says some who who says some shit like that? Who says some spiritual lyrics? The man knew he was a god. The man knew he was a living legend. Y'all gotta listen. I mean, he wants he's he's disappointed because he feels like people are not really listening to his lyrics. Uh, the song comes to mind to me is blasphemy. Don't front that blasphemy. Remember what my pops told me? Remember what my pops told me? My family tree consists of drug dealers, 
thugs and killers. Man, hey, man. Y'all got to listen to pop music. Really listen to his words, man, because that shit like the Bible. It's better than the Bible because it's truth. The Bible got truth in it, but the Bible got a bunch of lies in it, too. But the Bible got a bunch of fear in it, too. You know, and your spirit can see that if you conscious. But, yes, man, Pac is almost on the God level, which he on, on the same level as Jesus Christ. You know, he's almost on that level in the spiritual world. Like I said, probably about two or three more incarnations, he's going to be there. He's going to be a God. And, uh, yeah, he's doing good up there. Um, he talked about Jada Pinkett. He talked about, he talked about the women that, that was his heart, his mom and Jada, you know, he was real close. They, they, he was real close to them in spirit and on the physical plane on earth. But yeah, man. Uh, so yeah, Pac, Pac is doing good and, and he's, he's, he's no longer attached to the feelings of who he was on this planet, you know, he's no longer the same Pac, y'all. He's no longer that same guy. He's ascended. He's better. He's more complete. He's better. He's no longer that same Tupac, you know, because he's a spirit up there, like a soul, and he he he's had many lives. He's had lives where he was a where he was a woman. He had lives when he was a man. You know he had he had lives when he was a different race, a Mexican or a Caucasian. You know, a Arab, a Asian. He's he's had all he's had he's had these past lives, man. So he's he, he's a light being right now. You know he's a light being. And uh, he just he has access to his life as Tupac, and he's given us the memories he's had as Tupac, you know. But that's what we that's what we all do. We 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 all have past lives, like you know. We all can accept. I mean, when we get back up there in the spirit world, we're gonna see all the lives that we had previous, and we can assess those memories of those lives, and then dictate to a channeler. Okay, in this life I was an Asian woman. And so I can speak to my to my relatives in those memories and pass on uh what I want to say to a channeler to them. Then I can go to another different uh life where I was a you know, a Caucasian and I can pass on, you know, what I want to say to a channeler to the relatives of that life. You know, so that's what Pac is. You know, he's going to come back. He's going to go re and reincarnate into this country around Italy. He's going to be a doctor around the year 2023. And uh, he's going to have, he's going to live, live the experience of that life. It's no longer going to be Pac, you know. So, yeah, that's what all our souls, spirit do, you know. We just we just put on a costume and we come down here and play a role like a movie. We put on our costume, come down here and play a role, and then go back up to the spirit world for the next life, for the next role. It's like a movie. But, yeah, that's pop. And, uh... Yeah, man. So, like I said, he can access that pop, that membrane. He can access that, and then he can talk. He can talk about. He can talk from that aspect. But like I said, he's he wants people to listen to his music more, to really listen, to really listen to his lyrics, because a, a lot of these, a lot of uh, a lot of us are missing. Just don't bump your head to the beat. Really listen to what he's saying. That's what he want from us. And he, he wants us to have bigger goals and better and bigger ambition. That way he said also, he said, we don't know how powerful we are. So you don't really know how powerful you are, man. 
think big. Think the think you know. Think of the bigger picture. Just don't think small. Think of the whole picture, the big picture. Think big. He said that too because he said we are very powerful and don't know it. It's like we forgot we we Superman, but we forgot we Superman. You know. It was it was on some manifest your reality type stuff. But yeah, that's it. Tupac always alive. We never die. Tupac from the from the spirit world. Peace out.